So you touched on FHA short sales. We know from dealing with hundreds of short sale cases and agents that most agents don't have the knowledge base that you know, seller calls them, they haven't gone through the FHA waterfall, they haven't even applied for a loan modification, they just can't be thrown into a short sale. There's a process that they have to follow. If you could touch on that, and then also if you could touch on, you know, with FHAs it's a little bit different process. It doesn't go through the equator system. Correct. Currently the FHA process is very rigid. And I will tell you that the cycle times for FHA for approval and closings are significantly longer than they are for traditional short sales or other investors. I find that 40% of the escalations that I see end up where the agent and the homeowner never went through the waterfall of retention options, basically a loan modification. In many cases, it's because the homeowner doesn't want anything to do with the property anymore. But unfortunately, they cannot opt out of the process. They have to go through all of the waterfall of options. So starting locally with a HUD counselor or with our customer assistance center would be great. We do have a process with FHA today that is somewhat archaic. It is a paper fax. It is done with a centralized team in Jacksonville, Florida. We have great people working on it. However, as you understand, when you're working with a good platform and software, make things that create efficiencies in the business, we're going back to completely inefficient. Now, the good news is, hopefully in April, we will have FHA on Equator. VA will not be on Equator and probably never will be, but FHA should be on Equator. And I think just the simple repetitive nature of the tasks the centralized repository of where all information is, and as a communication platform, it should dramatically reduce the cycle time on FHA. But very important that the homeowner starts the entire waterfall of options. Now, one thing we haven't touched on yet is we have, and most of our competitors do, but I think Bank of America probably has some of the best information when we call it our home transition guide. We utilize it at single service events where we may invite 15,000 distressed homeowners. It is a color branded PDF format that the agent can download as many times as they would like. It's 40 pages and goes through every single option that a homeowner may have. Forbearance, loan modification, ramifications of a short sale, but by their credit, tax, deficiency, what happens in a foreclosure, what happens in relocation assistance, job employment services, United Way services, everything possible. The reason I think it's so important for agents to use that, especially in an FHA, but in all transactions, it is, it, it is first of all, gives you credibility. It is branded from the servicer in which you're talking about. Secondly, they're not going to interpret anything you've said as advice because you have an independent third party laying out all the facts for them, so you're putting them in the best possible position. And finally, once they feel they've exhausted all options, they'll be more likely, rather than seeing a random solicitation or trying to for a loan modification after they've been turned down three or four times, they've come to the realization they want to move to the next stage in their life, and we want to make that transition as smooth as possible. Absolutely want everyone to exhaust all options possible. However, a short sale is a much better option than any foreclosure.